as the disciples were gazing up towards heaven, angels appeared unto them and said, This same Jesus, which is taken up from you into heaven, shall so come in like manner as you have seen him go into heaven. This is your daily devotional, Maranatha, the Lord is coming. Maranatha, a daily devotional by Ellen G. White. The Special Resurrection And many of them that sleep in the dust of the earth shall awake, some to everlasting life, and some to shame and everlasting contempt. Daniel 12 verse 2 It was at midnight that God chose to deliver his people. As the wicked were mocking around them, suddenly the sun appeared, shining in his strength, and the moon stood still. Dark, heavy clouds came up and clashed against each other, but there was one clear place of settled glory, whence came the voice of God like many waters, shaking the heavens and the earth. There was a mighty earthquake. The graves were open, and those who had died in faith under the third angel's message, keeping the Sabbath, came forth from their dusty beds, glorified to hear the covenant of peace that God was to make with those who had kept his law. Those who sleep in Jesus will be called from their prison house to a glorious immortality. He has risen, dear friends, and in your despondency, you may know that Jesus is by your side to give you peace. I know what I'm talking about. I have seen the time when I thought the waves were going over my head. In that time, I felt my Saviour precious to me. When my eldest son was taken from me, I felt my grief was very great. But Jesus came to my side, and I felt his peace in my soul. The cup of consolation was placed to my lips. And then he who had stood by my side for 36 years was taken. We had laboured together side by side in the ministry, but we had to fold the hands of the warrior and lay him down to rest in the silent grave. Again, my grief seemed very great, but after all came the cup of consolation. Jesus is precious to me. He walked by my side and he will walk by your side. When our friends go into the grave, they are beautiful to us. It may be our father or mother that we lay away. When they come forth, those wrinkles are all gone, but the figure is there, and we know them. We want to be prepared to meet these dear friends as they come forth in the resurrection morning. Shall we lay hold upon the hope set before us in the gospel that we shall be like him, for we shall see him as he is?